and climate change, the safest place in the world to live doesn't exist. I'm Jim Anderson, Philip S. Well Professor in the Department of Chemistry, Earth Sciences, and School of Engineering at Harvard University. The first thing I was very proud of was we had built an instrument that flew into the Antarctic vortex and established the cause of the Antarctic ozone hole. And today I've been working on how very small amounts of chemical release at the surface can affect the global distribution of ozone, the single molecule that protects all life at the planet's surface. I spent my very early childhood building airplanes, repairing engines. These projects got bigger and bigger until my father had to take the window out at the end of the basement to get the project out of the house. <laughs> so when I got to graduate school, I started building instruments and it was just a natural extension. The storms that are now becoming endemic in the United States became of immediate concern to us. Understanding the facts related to this are crucial because it's the irreversibility in climate change that is so serious. So we have two choices. Either we go down together or we all go up together with a completely clean footprint and we work ourselves back out of this climate problem.